Hey guys, it's John, and today we are playing Late Night Wanderer. This is a free horror game available on Itch.io. I'll link it in the description. Been eyeing it for a couple weeks now. It kind of reminds me from the outside, like that game I played, Nighttime Visitor, that I actually really ended up enjoying, even though it was very short and simple. It's about walking home late at night, hence the term Late Night Wanderer. I'm working on some longer videos at the moment, but they're not ready, so I'll just post this in the meantime. Check it out. Neato. Okay. So... There's literally no one. Except that car up there. We look like we're in, like, a downtown area, so... Pretty odd that there's no one out. I guess the nightlife in this city freaking sucks. Do I have a flashlight? Oh. Aha! Taxi, with no one inside it? I hope so. Oh, there it is. Hey, it was good catching up. Don't get murdered on your way home. Ha ha. Not funny, Emma. Not funny at all. What time is it? 2.35? We have 10% battery. Charge your freaking phone, dude. Oh, I think I'm gonna walk home at 2.30 with a dying phone. This dude deserves to get murdered. Okay, looks like we've got a fork in the road up here. Yeah, there's no way I'm going down there. There's no way, sorry. Okay, looks like I'm going down there. Uh, right. <laughs> what? You sure you know the way home? Lots of construction going on. Yeah, I just ran into it. I'm pretty sure I know my way home, though. I think I know where I live. If I don't, again, I deserve to get murdered. So, are we living in a world without Uber or Lyft? Somebody was in that taxi. Could we just get a taxi home? Help. Yeah, that's what I want to see written on the wall. 6%?! Phone's dying super fast! Who is that? Someone on a late night jog? Where'd they come from? They came from the wall. Okay. Literally no one out tonight. Do people even live here? There's cars. Three percent? Press the home button. Close out some of your apps. They drain your battery. Is that a person up there? That is. They're walking away. Yeah, you better run. I'm coming after you. Oh, what if there's a twist like, we're the murderer? What? Oh, hello. This doesn't look like it's an intended passage. Maybe we do want to chase after whoever that person is. Oh, okay, never mind. This is just the other side of where we were earlier. So there's a person up ahead. It's just the traffic lights. Right? Hi. How how is the how are there no lights here? I got to say the infrastructure in the city is really not impressing me. Half the lights <laughs> in the street aren't working. Text me when you get home, lots of weirdos out and about. You seem really preoccupied with me getting murdered on the way home. 
Some kind of fantasy of yours? I think there's someone standing in the middle of the street up there. Yeah, there is. Let's go, let's go murder them. What are they doing? Is that the person who was jogging? I guess they're not really that into exercise. Hey. Hey. I'm here. Oh, you think you can get away with not being murdered that easily, huh? Check it out. What? Where'd you go? Oh, uh, you know, on second thought, I don't think the you're the murderer twist is coming. What? Those were not my footsteps. I heard doubled up footsteps. What? Okay. Okay. We'll just keep going. So someone just killed the lights. <sighs> right. Yeah. Let's, let's go. One percent. Oh! Phone's dead. What? That's Spanish? I heard. I heard Bellas and Los Puertos? The doors? Listen, I don't want to know what's on your mixtape, all right? Just keep it to yourself. Okay, maybe we should just go. I can't see. What is going on in that sewer? <laughs> what is going on? I'm sorry, if I'm a taxpayer in this city, I'm getting ripped off. Hi. Oh, it just happens to be foggy over there. Uh, that's fine, I'll leave. Oh, oh, we can sprint now. We couldn't sprint before. Is that our home? Uh... Well, I think I know why all the lights keep going out. Somebody over here is hogging all the power. Oh. Oh, nothing happened. <laughs> and we made it home safely. <laughs> okay. So that was Late Night Wanderer. We got some comforting music here. You know what? I'll give you a better ending. Here's a better ending for this game. You only you only have to add like one tiny scene at the end. You walk into your house, you close the door, you lock the door, whatever, and then like maybe you can walk around your house a little bit. Like, oh, I think I need uh you know some Nyquil or something, and you go into the kitchen for Nyquil, and then like I don't know, you you take it with a glass of water. And there's like a window in the kitchen. You look out the window and there's someone there. Just some sort of shadow there. And then they walk away. And then the game ends. That's all you need. That would be a, that would be a, a, a better finale. But maybe the ending is what they intended. Which is just that it was all your imagination. I definitely didn't imagine somebody whispering to me in a foreign language though. I definitely didn't imagine that dude jogging and then putzing around. In the darkness. What's the matter with that person? In that fog. Okay, well, that was Late Night Wanderer. Um, other than my uh, altered ending, here's my feedback. Uh, neat idea, nice atmosphere. I think maybe the ambient sound effects were a little too random. Um, I think I heard glass break like five times. I think they could have been more fine-tuned. 
But I understand, you know, three people. Maybe this was a student project. It doesn't say on the Itch.io page, but I think it could have been a more curated experience. Uh, you know, and less like baby's first horror game in a lot of places. Like, being whispered out in that hallway was kind of creepy, but I think I would have preferred something more nuanced, something that really took me by surprise, rather than like, Ooh, sewer steam jump scare that happened twice and you know I mean there are some good aspects to this game I think it could definitely be improved on quite a bit if if they were to make maybe a slightly uh, tighter version of this with a new ending I think it could be like a really cool free experiment but uh, as it stands now kind of just Nothing happens, which if that's the ending that they wanted, all, all the more power to them. But I, th I think it would be creepier to realize that like, yes, you were being followed at the end rather than just like, oh, you made it safely home. I wonder if there was a way to die even because it didn't seem like we were ever really in danger. And I think the element of danger needs to be present in horror games. You don't want people to be desensitized to dying over and over again. So you don't want too much danger or just like constantly being barraged with it throughout the experience, but you don't want it to be just kind of a, a walk in the park, literally. And that's kind of more the angle this game took. But you know, like I said, it's just a free little uh, game put up by these three people, so. Great, we need we need more horror games. So glad glad to play it, and uh, let me know what you guys thought in the comments about Late Night Wanderer. I will be back with a uh, longer game. I I've, I've been trying to post longer games uh, recently because I feel like there's more more substance to them generally, and sometimes it's just a drag to play like a really long game and. Uh, you know, you find that it's mostly empty, but I've been trying to make the videos feel denser and more exciting. So this was a little bit of an odd one lately for me, but hopefully a short one will be nice anyway. I don't know why I'm saying anymore. I'll see you guys in the next video. Think critically.